Now the Kaduna State Government plans to implement a digital tax administration system to boost its internally generated revenue IGR. This will allow the state to execute projects and deliver services more effectively rather than relying solely on federal allocations. Governor Uba Sani announced this initiative at a three-day Northwest Regional Capacity Training for Tax Officers organized by the Joint Tax Board JTB in Kaduna. Now, the training focused on tax audit, investigation, compliance and enforcement. This is intended to enable tax officers to generate more revenue for their respective state and perform their duties more effectively. In his remarks, the governor, represented by the deputy, Dr. Hadiza Balarabe, stated that the state will prioritize the internal revenue service to achieve its desired revenue targets. Kaduna State Internal Revenue Service has taken a giant step in deploying digital technology in tax administration in the state when it introduced a cross-sector system for revenue administration to create a robust and transparent revenue administration system for the state. I employ the service to go further and ensure that it puts a plug on revenue leakages that may still be existing within the state. As tax administrators, you play very crucial roles in ensuring a fair and efficient tax system that will support the development and growth of our communities. And by effectively administering tax laws and regulations, you will contribute greatly to sustainable funding of public services and infrastructure that benefits all citizens. Now, the executive chairman of the Kaduna State Internal Revenue Service, Jerry Adams, reveals that the current administration performed better last year in managing the state's resources for development. He urged taxpayers to be diligent as it is their civic responsibility and warned that the law will catch up with any defaulter. Meanwhile, the secretary of the Joint Tax Board, Olushego Adeshokong, highlighted the, that the essence of the workshop, which is to reposition the tax authorities in Nigeria to enhance their capacity and capabilities. The economy is in a very bad state, so um, the, there is heavy reliance on IGR to be able to uh, provide uh, infrastructure and uh, to meet up with the, uh, with the dividends of uh, democracy. Every eligible taxpayer to pay tax and if you are not paying tax, it means that um, you are a lawbreaker. And um, don't be found in the wrong side of the law. Because uh, the law has no friend. It has no brother or sister. So we are going to be strict on the dictates of the law, of our laws. We have our laws and uh, we enforce it daily. We realize that there are number one skills gap was tax audit, investigation, compliance, and enforcement. So the training sessions we're having today, tomorrow, and Friday is a response, is a response to that need. And we expect that by the time we're done with training, uh, the revenue officers from the six states in the um, zone will have been properly equipped to handle and conduct tax audits and investigations, and also to know how to go about enforcing um, tax um, payers who have refused to comply.